everyone and welcome on back to the channel thank you as always for being here hope you're having a lovely day out there wherever you may be you may be in grand rapids michigan you may be in seattle washington you may be i don't know tokyo japan you may be somewhere but you're here right now and i appreciate you stopping by let's go ahead and listen to judy suke i'm hoping i pronounced her name uh, correctly i did not look that up we're going to listen to judy today uh, we're going to listen to the track welcome to the cruise which is the self or off of that's the title track for <laughs> so let me start over welcome back to the channel thank you so much for being here we're listening to judy suke uh, i'm hoping that's i pronounced that right we're listening to the track welcome to the cruise which is also the title track of the album which is also the first song off of the album the first track released in 1979 uh, I have never, as far as I know, heard her or heard anything by her, but I was, ba-bam, gifted the album right here, and uh, this was recommended so many times, specifically by Hippo YNYR, so thank you so much, so much for the recommendation, I appreciate it. Uh, let's just, listen, let's just go ahead and listen to the first track here, let's go ahead and put the headphones on, we'll talk about it after, here, hold on, here we Go. I gotta turn the volume up, sorry. expecting guys
No. Mmm. Mmm. How long is this album? 40 minutes? I want to do a full album listen to this. <laughs> I don't have time right now, though. That's the problem. But I want to do a full album listen of this. Um, this is beyond what I was expecting. So when I listen to a new artist, a new band that I don't know, based off the name, I just have certain assumptions. I just, I just go a certain way, right? As anyone does. Like when you go to the record shop and you may not have heard a band, but you're looking at the album cover and the, out, the artwork like you assume and you make assumptions based off of that. For some reason, I was just thinking that this would be like folk music or something folk related, which I'm completely fine with. That's just what I was going in expecting. But I'm getting like a an art pop, progressive kind of pop. I don't know. The, the structure and the composition of everything is beyond what I was expecting. Judy herself, the, the singing, I love her singing in there, especially the chorus, the ooh, like that. That sends me down to like a Japanese city pop kind of sound. Like when she goes into that. And then like, okay, when it first started, I was like, okay, this is kind of what I'm expecting, right? Like when it first started. Okay. I'm, I'm, that's like a sound that I'm kind of getting. Okay. I know where we're going here. But no, oh, I was wrong. I was very wrong. Because as soon as... The groove... I'm oh, sorry. When the groove came in so strong hard melodic piano groove and bass guitar riff just mm, like everything in there was just so tasty and and i wasn't expecting that this is and i'm basing this off of a first listen off the first song i've ever heard from judy um this has the polished veneer of steely dan that that strong instrumentation which you can hear it in here and i'm looking at the personnel list and it is filled there are a lot of musicians on here. Some that stand out to me. You got Steve Nye, who, I, who has worked with David Sylvian. You have Simon Phillips on the drums. Morris Pert. But you got some people on here. Um, and it shines through brilliantly. And even the names that I don't recognize. Like, you can hear how strong the musicianship in here is. I love the break in here. And a lot of times, obviously, a break is used to break away from the verse chorus, away from that structure. Here is no different, but it breaks away so fantastically, becomes slightly ambient. Some, I don't know exactly what, there's an instrument in there, I don't know what it was, but it, it brings this, this spiritual quality into the music before it blitzes into a guitar solo that melts our faces off and then brings it back in for that final chorus, of which the chorus is incredibly catchy. The, the verse is wonderfully catchy, but there's a lot going on here. And you heard how on the back end it was leading into the next track. This is the, this is one of those those songs, perhaps albums, that yeah, I listened to the first track right now, but I wish I saved it for an album listen. If I knew it was gonna be like this, I might have to do something about that. I may do something about that later. Don't want no darkness in my days, I wanna tell you that. Don't want no clouds to fill my skies, no more goodbyes. I know that this time you have come to me and run in on me. Good love is running in on me. Don't try to dim my eyes. Don't ever try to live my life. Welcome to the cruise. Love come down and run in on me. No words from me will ever or will change your ways. I want to tell you that nothing that I see will change your days. Nothing will change. Because I know this time you have come to me. Come to run with me. I know you want to run with me. Don't try to take my time. Don't question what is on my mind. Honey, you come running over here to me. You're going to end up being run over. Don't want no darkness in my days. I've got to tell you that. Don't want no clouds to fill my skies. She's doing good. She's, she's doing completely fine. She don't need you around to, to cloudy her days. Don't want the earth. No crooked lies. Don't want the night. No more goodbyes. Hurt me once. Shame on me. Hurt me twice. Bye. <laughs> no. No. Mm. That is really good. Genuinely impressed. Surprised. Was not expecting that. Love it. I would like to indulge in some more. Let me know what you guys thought.
However, the, you know what? Hey, and, and a very special shout out, a very special shout out to Hippo, because Hippo, you have suggested uh, Judy, I'm scrolling, like many, many times. I'm trying to find the earliest instance in which you've suggested Judy to me. And I'm going back four years, four years ago. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe I will make up for lost time. Let me know what you guys thought of the track in the comments below. You can follow me over on Twitter, support me over on Patreon if you wish. I hope you enjoyed the music. I, yeah, yeah. Have a great day and I'll see you all later. Bye.